Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Ichi here. If this is your first time on my channel, hi, my name is Onye and I'm a content creator living in Manchester, England. Don't make it your last time here. Subscribe and catch up on other videos. So today's video, we're doing a what I eat in a day video. Cook with me, all that good stuff. First of all, I'm looking all glammed up because I just finished filming a video and I've waited for the rain to stop actually before I start recording because I have to go out to buy groceries to use to cook today. But it hasn't stopped so i'm going to go out under the rain like that to manage but today we're going to do a what i eat in a day i'll let you guys know everything that i eat in a day or that i'm going to be eating today i'm also going to cook so you guys are going to cook with me the major meal that i want to make today is jello fries and i want to make it in a different way from the way that i make it because i saw a recipe on youtube and i really want to try it out so i'm hoping it comes out really nice then i need to get something to eat this morning most of the time I eat around 12. That's like what the time is now. That's when I eat my breakfast. Then I cook around like four. So I eat that as lunch slash dinner. Then I get something to snack on at night. That's literally how I eat. I don't really eat three times, like three major meals in a day, maybe two and one snack and that's fine. I'm also not on any diet strict diet or anything so i'm not exactly counting calories or you know trying to eat healthy like they say i'm just trying to eat to be honest today at least for today i'm just trying to eat okay so yeah first of all i need to get to sainsbury to do my grocery shopping some of the things that i need to cook today um i picked sainsbury one because if i see one more video about a four Ayamashe and Gizdodo that Sainsbury now makes on TikTok. I might lose my mind to be very honest guys I just might lose it. So I've seen a lot of things about how Sainsbury now has an African or Nigerian food line Because they have ready meals for like Chinese Indian food as well. So now they have the Nigerian one. So they have a four they have um Gizdodo they have Ayamashe as well. I think they have one other thing that I can't really remember right now I think is your father? I'm not sure yeah they have that and i want to go in their store to try and buy it because i've seen a lot of videos on tiktok so i don't take a four but i like his dodo so i'm going to try i'll get the giz dodo maybe i might buy the f4 and have my flatmate try it out i'm not sure but today we're going to find it and then we're going to try it out because if that thing bangs if it bangs that's the end of me stressing myself to go and buy plantain trust myself to go and buy meat from african store we'll just buy it on our way back from class microwave it and eat it at night i just pray it bangs that's all i'm praying for yeah so if you guys are not subscribed subscribe let me get my shopping bag and let's hit saint <laughs> So I've been unable to find the Gizdo and the F4 at all. I can't find it. I'm on the final I'll check in now. If I don't find it here then it's good night.
my place to leave The grass ain't always green Oh, exactly what it seems I'm just trying to find The meaning in this life I'm exactly on time With my own finish I fell down, got these cuts and bruises All these bruises and these scars It's a different place Where I'm supposed to grow I won't ever change for the season I fell down, got these cuts and bruises All these bruises and these scars It's a different place And bruises, all these wounds, turn to scars. No such thing as lose. And now I stand tall, so my roots are moving. I won't ever change for the seasons. I fell down, got these cuts and bruises, all these wounds, turn to scars. No hey guys, so my first meal is ready. I made a sandwich. I used wheat bread. Of course, you guys saw how I made it, but I used wheat bread. I used cheese, chicken, and lettuce so my the inspiration behind this was actually one day i was craving chickweed i'm like okay i want to make chickweed but i love cheese i love cheese so i decided to add cheese to my chickweed the chickweed that I was meant to make yeah um and i made it one day and it banged and i decided to try it now but the first time i made it i made it with like normal um bread but now i'm using wheat bread because i just changed like the bread that i take um i actually like wheat bread yeah so Let's have it back. Can you guys see the steam that's coming out of this? It's so hot. I love it because my cheese has melted. Like when the cheese melts, we're ready to eat. People that take cold cheese, people are not normal, to be honest. Mm. You guys see that pull from the cheese? Mm. Now, this tastes so good, guys. I'm going to pour myself some juice and then finish eating up. When it's time for lunch, I'll talk to you guys. Yes, I burned the first one because I was busy doing other things and I was not paying attention, but the burnt nice will add some flavor to it, right? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, let me finish up eating and then we'll make our jollof rice. <laughs>
Hey guys, so it's time for me to eat my dinner. At this point, I'm going to call it dinner because it is too late. Like, this food took longer than I thought. The method that I use actually took longer. Normally, it takes me like an hour, 30 minutes to make jello fries. This thing took me over two hours because they were emphasizing on frying the tomato, making sure it's very, very dry. The tomato fries very well. Um, so I hope it's worth it. So let us try it out. Um, still hot, so I have to blow it. Uh, it tastes really nice like it's almost like patty rice like it has that you know that patty jollof taste you get yeah it tastes like really really good guys and this is what i'm going to eat this night okay i'm gonna get my snack like much later but for now i'm having this really nice jollof rice some people like to add like other things to their jollof rice i wanted to add the yellow pepper to the jello fries but i was so tired to start chopping it because i wanted to chop it and then add it so but me i'm actually a very simple person even when you come to my indomie i like it almost plain like i'll probably just add maybe sausage to my indomie i'm not i feel like if you start to add carrots all those other things to jello fries it's no longer jello fries you're already on the way to making jambalaya rice or jello fried rice something like that so i just like my jello fries very plain and i have Two pieces of chicken here to use to wash it down and i'm i'm gonna drink water i'm not taking any juice nothing sweet nothing just water is fine and is what is good for your body so drink water so let me eat guys i'll be back when i am making my smoothie which is the final thing i'm gonna take just before i go to bed i'm trying to see you focus on me Honestly, I'ma notice You got a whole lot of tension You just need to blow up Honey Got a body you can show off Show off to just me You ain't no microwave shawty Whole lot of pressure Yeah You're expensive Take all my time Tell me if you're worth the heartache now. Take it inside, stuck in your prime. Tell me what you want, tell me what you need. You got me wasted, so You got me tattooed in the choke. I'm trying to see you focus on me. Honestly, I'm a notice. Hey guys, so that's pretty much it for everything that I eat in a day. I'm going to have my smoothie before I go to bed. I think I want to keep it in the freezer a bit more so it gets like super cold. Sometimes I add ice when blending it or I don't like the sound the blender makes when I put ice in it. So I prefer to just, first of all, make it and then put it inside the freezer for it to get really cold. Um, yeah, but it tastes really good, okay. I normally don't add honey, but I like the fact that I added it and it tastes really really good so this is a nice combo that you guys can try i switch my milk from regular milk to oat milk i'm trying to add more healthy substitutes in my diet or what i eat yes um, i'm not trying to have like a quick diet change i'm just trying to you know have like healthier substitutes here and there i feel like it would also help with like getting or living a healthier lifestyle Yo, so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Um, please like if you haven't and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.
inside Stuck in your pride